the top 5 cycles from Silver Bank. Hey guys and welcome back to the channel. In today's video, I'm going to be reviewing the top 5 cycles from Silver Bank. Now for those of you who don't know, Silver Bank is a German brand and they make a nice set of cycles ranging from MTBs all the way up to road bikes. This collection is quite vast and they do have a good reputation all over. This is now available in India too. They are officially in India through a distributor. So in this video, I'm going to be showing you the top 5 cycles from Silverback. At number 5, we have the Silverback Stride SE. The track on this bike is at 21 speed and the derailers rear and front are from Microshift. On the front, we have a 100mm zoom suspension. This does not have a lockout but it does have a load adjuster. Braking is provided by V brakes. Though this comes with V brakes, if you are looking at upgrading to disc brakes in future, the mounts are already ready. So you just need to add it, change your wheels, add your disc brakes, and you're all set to go. The wheels on this bike are 27.5 inch tires and they are mounted on double wall alloy rims. The 680mm handlebar is mounted on a 55mm stem. There are two accessory mounting points and a plastic pedal is standard. Quick release levers are available on both the wheels and the seat post. This bike weighs at about 15 kgs and is priced at 32,500 rupees. Number 4, we have a women's specific bike, the Silverback Splash Sport. And yes, it does kind of match with my shirt. The track on this bike is a 1x8. So at the back, you have an 8 speed cassette, which has a nice wide range with Microshift Advent derailers. Now this derailer comes with a clutch so it gives you better control when you're on the trails. On the front you have a 32 tooth crank and this comes with a chain guide so the chance of the chain falling off whichever gear you're in is very very low. The 720mm handlebar is mounted on a 65mm stem. The brakes and gear shifters are in separate units. On the front, you have a Zoom Vaxa air suspension. This is a 110mm suspension with a lockout. Braking is provided by dual hydraulic disc brakes. These disc brakes are from NUT. The 27.5 inch tires are mounted on tubeless ready double ball alloy rims. Metal pedals are standard as are two accessory mounting points. Quick release levers are available on both the wheels and the seat post. This bike weighs in about 14 kgs. The price on this bike? Well, the number 4 bike, a women's specific bike, is priced at 58,000 rupees. At 
at number 3, we have the hybrid, the Silverback Cento Park HD. The traction of this bike is at 24 speed. The 8 speed cassette at the rear has a micro shift mezzo derailleur. The three cranks in the front also shift using a micro shift derailleur. On the front, you have 80mm zoom area suspension. This suspension has a load adjuster and a lockout. The 660mm alloy handlebar is mounted on a 65mm stem. The brakes and gear shifters are mounted on separate units. The 700x40C tires are mounted on double wall alloy rims. These rims are tubeless ready. Braking is brought by dual hydraulic disc brakes from NUT. Metal pedals are standard as are two axis mounting points. Quick release levers are available on both the wheels and the seat post. The number 3 bike weighs in at about 13.5 kgs and is priced at 55,000 rupees. So for those guys of you who have been watching this closely, you know that I've changed my watch. This is the Garmin Epix. It's a really nice OLED display with touchscreen. If you want to know 5 reasons to buy the Garmin Epix, check out this video. It's on my second channel. And let me know what you guys think. And now back to the list. At number 2, we have the Silverback Stride MD. The traction of this bike is a 21 speed. The 7 speed cassette at the rear has a micro shift derailleur. The 3 cranks in the front also has a micro shift derailleur. On the front, we have a zoom backstop suspension. This comes with a lockout and a load adjuster. The 720mm alloy handlebar is mounted on a 65mm stem. Brakes and gear shifters are on separate units. The 29 inch tires are mounted on tubeless ready double wall alloy rims. Braking is provided by mechanical disc brakes. Metal pedals are standard as are two accessory mounting points. Quick release levers are available on both the wheels and the seat post. This bike weighs in about 14 kgs. The number 2 bike weighs prices in at about 41,000 rupees. At number 1, the Silverback Stride Sport. The drive on this bike is a 1x8. The 8 speed cassette at the rear has a micro shift advent derailleur. This derailleur comes with a clutch. The 32 tooth crank in the front has a chain guide. The Zoom Vaxa air suspension of the front is a 110mm suspension. This comes with a lockout.
The 740mm alloy handlebar is mounted on 65mm stem. The brakes and gear shifters are on separate units. The 29 inch tires are mounted on tubeless ready double wall alloy rims. Braking is provided by hydraulic disc brakes. Metal pedals are standard as are two accessory mounting points. Quick release is available on both the wheels and the seat post. This bike weighs in at about 14 kgs. The price of the number one bike on this list 56,000 rupees. So guys, that was my list of the top 5 cycles from Silverback. My favourite, obviously the number 1. But do you guys have a different favourite? Comment below and let me know. That's it for now. Don't forget to subscribe and do share with your friends. Until next time, safe ride everyone.